Hi, let's see how to fix the Cyberpunk 2077 crash on loading the save games. Cyberpunk 2077 is a action video game set in the Night City where you can play a cyberpunk mercenary. This game has gained the immense popularity since its inception. But unfortunately, like any complex game, Cyberpunk is also faced with the certain issues, one of which the player space is not able to load their saves but no one knows exactly what is happening. Okay, so why is Cyberpunk 2077 crashes on loading the save game? The first cause is system requirement, the second cause is mods and custom content, the third cause is outdated graphic drivers. So let's see how to fix the Cyberpunk 2077 crash on loading the save games. First method is check the device compatibility. First of all, make sure that your system confirms at least the minimum requirement of the game check the minimum and the recommended requirements below okay so these requirements uh, RAM graphic card and disk space needed to play the game so this is the minimum requirement of the game but it is recommended to have a good uh, compatibility and the good configuration of the system with the Windows 10 and I uh, core i7 processor with the memory of 16 GB RAM and uh, G430 X graphic card uh, with the DirectX of version 12 storage of 70 GB available space additional load is SSD recommended. The second method is update the Cyberpunk 2077. Always make sure that you are using the latest or the updated version of the game. If you are using the older or the outdated version of, of the application, you will face this kind of issues. Okay, so in order to update for the Steam, you can follow these steps. If you want to update for the Xbox, you can follow these steps sequentially one by one. In order to update for the Playstone, you can follow these steps sequentially one by one. Okay. And the third method is remove mods. Mods are meant to enhance the gameplay, but they are also interference with the saves and can cause the crashes on the conflicts. So remove mods installed in the game one by one and then try to load the saves to see if the mods are causing this kind of issues. In order to do that manually, you can follow these steps sequentially one by one if you are using the mod manager and um, if you have used the mod manager like Vortex you can follow these steps sequentially one by one. Fourth method is update the graphic card. Ensure you, you, that your graphic cards are updated as per the game version. If not kindly consider updating them. You can update your graphic driver by following these steps sequentially one by one. Okay. So what you can do is like visit the manufacturer website for your graphic product. Now search for the most recent content driver, correct driver. So be sure to choose the driver that is compatible with the Windows version and update it. Fifth method is close background applications. Close any background applications or the process that may be using the system resources for playing the game. This includes the resource intensive applications, video editing software or the web browsers with the multiple tabs. Steps to close background applications are you can follow these steps sequentially one by one. The sixth method is turn off the cloud saves. Before removing the saves from the cloud, please make a backup of your saved files by navigating to the game saved directly and making them copy of them. You save locally and by default when you quit the game, your saves are uploaded to the cloud. So this may create the issues leading to the game crashes. Turn off the cloud save and you can follow these steps. For a GOG launcher, select the game, click on the customization button to play next. Select manage installation configure, disable the cloud saves by unticking the sync local saves with the GOG cloud option and the confirm OK. For Steam, once you log in, boot up the Steam, go to the uh, top left of the home screen and then click on stream options now go to the settings cloud and then remove the check mark enable the steam cloud synchronization for the application that supports it seven method is run as administrator to run the file as an administrator you can follow these steps sequentially only. the eighth method is verify the game files of the integrity there may be some corrupted files or saved files that could lead to the crashes in the gameplay so to fix this, verify the integrity of the game files. For Steam, you can follow these steps.
For GOG, you can follow these steps. For Epic Launcher, you can follow these steps. The ninth method is disable the antivirus. Whatever the antivirus you have installed in your system, just make sure to disable it or you can whitelist the particular application because these kind of antivirus treats these kind of applications as spam or malicious software. The tenth method is uninstall and reinstall the Cyberpunk 2077. Okay, so uninstall and reinstalling the Cyberpunk 2077 will resolve any kind of bugs or the glitches present in the system or the application. In order to do that, you can follow these steps. For PC, for Xbox, you can follow these steps. In order to do the same on the PlayStation, you can follow these steps. The 11th method is contact the project threat support team. If you have tried all the troubleshooting methods and if you are still facing the problem, you can contact the project tech support team. Okay, they will be able to help you and they will be uh, happy to help you if you are facing any kind of problem. They are the expertise, they will help you to fix the issues. Okay, so that's all about this. Thank you.